this, today's theme is creative developing. Okay. So we're going to... <laughs> this is a deal or no deal. I haven't seen one of these before. This is where I grab an opportunity that's landed on my desk. Could have come. So that'll be about four fifty thousand to build per side, and yep. something for about one point two each after. Oh, that's great. So just a real quick thing, way. That's a, there's a good margin in there. You talk about my development. I never know what you're up to. Laura. No, you know what I'm up to. Uh, I've got an NDIS project over in Western Australia with a JV builder friend of mine, um, with ours, and um, it's a high care. So if you don't know much about NDIS, there's level one, two, and three. So the level three is very high care, which means. <laughs> Um, yeah, I was only going to go and have a look at it and see what the outcome was, and then I got caught up in it, and then... <laughs> <laughs> got excited. Got yeah, excited like, at the auction. <laughs> okay, so we bought a block around the corner from us, 8,000 square metres, it was going to be our PPR. So we fully went into it, we got designs for a building, we got finance from the bank, they were all good. We spoke to a town planner about it, he was okay with it. Then we went to council and they said, no, you need reticulated sewage. And uh, they said it's going to, so we went and got costing on that, it was going to cost $100,000. How's it going, man? You're still in lockdown, hey? Obviously. Still in lockdown. Who knows yeah, when you're going to yeah. get out of that? So you might as well just keep developing from home. Absolutely, mate. Absolutely. That's a beautiful yeah. thing about property development. All you need is a laptop, a phone, and a table. It could be done anywhere. <laughs> you make it sound easy. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> You've got to make it sound easy. <laughs> it's not always easy. No, it's not hard enough. Yeah. All right, so where are you up to? What are you doing? So, Give us a brief on it and then tell us where you're at. Yeah, so we're doing five townhouses um, and they're strutted. So mm. we were we were hoping to do Torrens, but we couldn't get Torrens on it. Um, but So we're doing Strata. And um, yeah, so they're three beds. They've got a little living room upstairs, a, you know, open plan living dining, um, two bathrooms. Our New South Wales roving report. <laughs> <laughs> Nolan Keenan. Because you're doing the same things, and I've got like that because that's from our past. You're doing the same things over and over. You know that saying? Do the same things over and over and expecting a different result. If you want a different result, you have to take different actions. So that's why I do this. Where are you right now? And what are you doing that's different? And the analogy I use, the windscreen on a car is far wider than the rear view mirror. We need to turn our gaze away from what we used to do and think, what do I do to go on my forward venture to go where I want to go? What's going to get me there? And so, so it's the actions you take today. Because if you think about everything you've ever done in the past got you to where you are now. You could be unhappy, you could not have enough money, you could be unhealthy, whatever that is, the actions that were accumulated over time got you to here. So it's just a choice and a decision. It's like, okay, I'm going to change that. What do I need to start doing from now 